All right, I got a good video today. Last two videos have been about the coronavirus. We're going to lighten the spirit up because I don't believe in feeding into the fear, but I do believe in being smart and knowing about what's going on and how to protect yourself by all means necessary. So those videos were vital, but in this video, today we're going to lighten it up, okay? Is it true that eating oatmeal can increase your milk supply? And is it true that drinking beer can increase your milk supply. I did a little research on both of those because I always hear those two. Drink some beer, girl. It'll um it'll it'll help you out with your milk supply. Eat a lot of oatmeal first thing in the morning. But does it really work? Before we get into the video, y'all know what y'all need to do. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm always making videos about pregnancy and childbirth and after birth, even doula care. So if that seems like something you would be interested in, go ahead and hit the bell, turn on those notifications when you subscribe, all right? I'm Crystal Devine, let's get into this video. Now, oatmeal, I have tested that theory. Um, especially the third time around I, I ate a lot of oatmeal I can say that I believed it helped but I can also say it wasn't like a big difference as far as the beer goes no I have not tried I have not tested that out personally I don't like beer so mm, no I I haven't tested that one out so I don't know but I also don't know much about beer, period. And I do know that there's a whole lot of different type of beers out there. There is a particular beer that is supposed to help with stimulating the milk production in our breasts, okay? There's a particular beer, so you can't just go get a Budweiser, can't go get a Corona or a Heineken and think that that's gonna work, no ma'am. The type of beer that is recommended is a stout beer, okay? This is a dark fermented beer with a number of variations, including dry stout, Baltic porter, milk stout, and imperial stout. I don't know what none of that means, okay? So what I found out is that all stout, or a basic stout, is just made up of what all beer is created from, but with a higher unmalted roasted barley content okay and the barley is the key ingredient that stimulates the hormone prolactin to increase milk supply so that's what makes stout beer specifically a milk stout one of the best beers for a breastfeeding woman to indulge in again I don't know too much about beer but this is what I found out and I also had came across this really really good blog um, it's an Ireland blog and um, if you don't know they're big drinkers big beer drinkers out there but in this blog the woman was basically saying how dark beer is used to increase the flow of breast milk in Ireland it has been a practice since the ancient Egyptians started making beer 5,000 years ago. I did not background check that fact, but I thought that was interesting. The woman also said that in 1821, they drank Guinness. The original Guinness is a stout, and it was known to have live yeast, which is rich in iron in their beers, unlike today, but their beers are still full of bark. She went on to list like eight milk stout beers that she would recommend pregnant women to drink for breastfeeding. I will put the link for that in the description box below in case any moms are interested in researching more about it or just reading the blog or just finding out what those beers are <laughs> that you can indulge in. Um, and she also did say, you know, a beer a day is key and not every single day was she recommending or her herself drinking these milk stout beers but over in Ireland they vouch for it they say it works she even went on ahead in her blog as to say how you know uh, friends of hers would bring oatmeal and milk stouts as a welcoming gift when they come home with the baby so 
Yeah, and speaking of oatmeal, let's get into oatmeal because oatmeal apparently has a lot of barley grain in it. So a bowl of oatmeal for breakfast is what is recommended for increasing milk supply. I did this for a little while. I was eating oatmeal every single morning and I do feel like it did help. Um, but it's so, you know, it's just so hard to tell because there were a combination of other things that I was doing as well to stimulate my milk production. So I can't ultimately say that was the one thing that did it for me, but I can say that it didn't hurt and it didn't decrease. And there's no scientific evidence that oatmeal has anything in it that will uh, stimulate milk production. But still, women out there vouch for it. I would even vouch for it. And lactation consultants um, vouch for it as well. That is something that they often tell women who are breastfeeding to do to increase their milk supply. But oatmeal is a super food. It contains iron, again, which is really good for stimulation. It's full of nutrients, proteins, vitamins, minerals, that all can be beneficial to stimulating milk production. So, apparently, the answer to the question is yes. A particular beer out there can help uh, stimulate milk production and yes, eating a bowl of oatmeal in the morning for breakfast every day is not going to hurt you. If anyone out there has tried this oatmeal or beer, any of the milk stouts that I was talking about earlier, please comment below. Let me know how it worked for you. What do you recommend? Do you agree? Do you disagree? So please share your story and your experiences in the comments below. Make sure you like this video as well. Thank you guys for tuning in to another one. This is all I have for you today, but I will see you guys on the next